At Chevron, we understand that we have a responsibility to build the capacity of the communities we live and work in. Increasing volunteer engagement, starting with ourselves, is one of the many ways we invest in our communities. In response to internal financial pressures, as well as a need for increased capacity in the community, private businesses are looking to employee volunteer programs as a key component of their overall corporate social responsibility portfolio going forward. The one thing that sets this year's winners apart is character. Their way of giving back to the community is true to who they are as an organization, lending the best of their gifts and talents to those who need it most. If we could all do that, what a wonderful world this would be. a small business IT firm here in Calgary. With four employees in our company, uh, some would think that it's pretty challenging to really get out there and help out in the community, but for me that's something that we had to do from the get-go, whether it's contributing to building a website, which we did for Brown Bagging for Calgary's Kids last year. Uh, there's just different ways you can get creative with using your time. We had a, a, a tragedy. <laughs> our website was hacked and uh, pulled down. So we were left without anything. We were left without a website. And the, web the website's our key contact with our schools and with our supporters. And what we said was, well, we want to help you guys out. And we helped them rebuild their entire website. At Brown Bagging, we always believe that the first important question that someone asks is, what can I do? But the really important question is, what else can I do? And Derek asked, what else can I do? Uh, when Eligio brought six people into the kitchen, I think we were doing 1,700 lunches. Um, they each helped prepare 280, feed 280 kids that day. So Mountain View Academy, they approached us about a year ago looking for a new IT provider. So we sat down with them to kind of identify their needs and just see where they wanted to go with their school. One of the challenges they face on a regular basis is acquiring new equipment, servers, and updated software and things like that. So one of the things we set out last summer was to apply for a grant at IBM worth forty-five dollars to $50,000. Uh, there was about forty to fifty. Um, potential grant recipients throughout North America. We were the only Canadian one and then we got the good news in August 31st that we'd been awarded a $45,000 grant which included software, hardware and even training for the systems to be put into Mountain View Academy. It is absolutely amazing. There's still things that we're learning about it because there's so many features on there um, but we're just absolutely tickled pink. Um, we're thrilled to have the opportunity to, we would never be able to have anything like this. Everything we have at this school is really second hand. I nominated Derek Major for this award because um, of the approach that he's taken to building his business and Derek made a concerted effort of integrating community as part of his natural business practice and uh, I think that's a characteristic and a, and a business decision that's not common. He does a, a lot of volunteer work, um, even with uh, working on our, helping to work on our website um, and just giving ideas and working with the students and, and such, so he's been a volunteer a great deal. The value you get from having your, your employees and your contractors and staff, even partners involved in these kinds of programs, the benefits are enormous for our organization.